pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. So, um, a piece of reasoning, is it? A reason is important. Um, a reason and him set the record straight. Yeah? Is that set the record straight reasoning, is it? So, Come in a wall of seat. Come in a forward, forward in a wall of seat. Because we have to clear up a few things. A few misunderstandings. A few disinformation. Yeah? We have to clear up. Yeah? So, welcome to the class where we keep it a hundred. See? Now, I posted a, 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 a clip from um, the, the interview with, with, um, with Spice and um, Nightly Fix last night on my page. Posted it very late. See? Come here, actually, got a studio and somebody pointed it out to me, so I had to post it last night. So, some of you may have seen it, and um, you know, everybody have their own opinion. But we don't need opinion when we have facts. You understand what I say? We don't need. We don't need for. Guess and spell things are be opinionated when we have facts. So we we'll present the facts. Because here we go now. When you can attack Mr. Vegas, um, on a personal level, um, one thing I go sit back and allow you to do is attack me, um, my work to attack my legacy in a dance hall. I'm going to try over the years to stigmatize my name, that no work. I'm going to try over the years to blacklist me, that no work. Well, that worked to a degree because certain levels of me different reach and I'm using it reach there because of the blacklisting from record label and artists and them type of thing there. So, when I um, realized all I want to throw at me. Never did I work and can never work. I say no, I want to try a different thing now. I want to try to attack my legacy. And that way, I want to have a problem. To the point where real problem, like serious problem, like legal problem. Yeah. So, I need to stand correct. Because here we go now, I want to mess with the youth, the money. You see? It's like how Bob Marley set him legacy for him, you them. You see, my seven children, when you try to attack my legacy, you mess with Carter Ray them, DeAndre them, CJ them, Taylor Ray them, Raina Jardin them money. And that's the problem, you know. When I mess with Jalani money. You see? When you try to mess with my legacy, Una mess with the children, them food. That not go work. So una have to stand correct. Una have to fix it. Una no have food followings and platform where thousands of people have view. To spread misinformation. Or fabricate the facts. Or fabricate story for, for, for counter the facts, excuse me. Or to go against the facts. You see? So that we have stand upon. The legacy of Mr. Vegas. You can't mess with that. Me work hard for that. Me fight through hurricane category 5. For have the legacy. Here. And you can't deny me that. Because I put in the work. For reach, which for me reach. Real work, 
true hurricane, thunderstorm, nightmares. So we can't attack that and think so we not just get away with that. So. No. We don't have to stand correct. Nightly flicks, we don't have to stand correct. We know that Spice has lied a long time and fabricated stuff. But Nightly Flix, we don't claim that we have a platform of speak and music. So if we have information, we don't have to put forward no cogent, we don't have to stand correct when we get corrected. We don't have idiot. We don't have to say idiot. We don't have idiot. We don't have fool. Hey boy, Nara, what do you do? Harry, you know what I do, you know? You know what I do, Bridget? What I do? What I do? You don't have to fix it. I want to say you name nightly fix. You don't have to fix it. You not idiot. I want to come in a journalism, you know? In a entertainment journalism. You don't have to fix it. You not idiot. You not idiot. If you don't fix it, it will go legal. I want to know. You don't have to fix it. I have the pit of them legacy. You not fool. You don't have to fix it. You take it. I think that is it. You take things personal because I think is it a case where you'd never do something to somebody like that? That's why I feel like that as well. I have asked him about a specific comment to somebody, Mr. Vegas. He called a media worker recording artist who should grow up and deliberately stirs the pot to promote new music. What do you think about that? How much time Mr. Vegas entered the Billboard chart? You can tell me since as you are. Um, you can you look it up? <laughs> no, don't laugh. A serious question. So, uno look it up. How much time Mr. Vegas has entered the Billboard chart because he used the word mediocre, mediocre. So let us stop. It's about here. like you must have and one numbers. solo hit by yourself and two with each other. Let us let us start numbers. Yeah, that numbers. All right, look it up. This says zero zero one sound. <laughs> 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 spice person over there, right? Well, well, let us. So, so how, and how much time has a spice entered a billboard chart? Because you have to talk numbers to these people so they can understand that there's levels to this music business. So, how am I a mediocre artist when you, as that have been in the industry longer than I have and have more accolades than you have? Make this make sense. May I look it up? Look it up so we can talk numbers. You have to understand there's these people in the industry, they have this jealousy and it not just come from woman, it come from man too. So make we talk about it. Man will jealous over woman. Man will jealous over woman. I posted a video where Mr. Vegas was throwing shots of my, of my surgery. Where my talk about, yeah. oh, oh, me do my breast and me do my bottom and me do me this and me do. I didn't even call my name. Oh, me I talk about nothing. Say I lie, the thing, me I hold you that self for spice. Like. Mm hmm Now first thing Maybe we're not oblivious to the facts So I'm educated you know. Mr. Vegas entered the billboard charts The billboard charts Like the top 100 songs In the United States of America One time Solo Me alone With pull up In the billboard Top 100. That we don't need for you to get right. That we don't need for you to come stand correct for nightly fix. Said so that top 100 billboard chart is a small percentage of Jamaican artists get into that chart. Or goes into that chart. See, going to that chart. Small percentage. That another little reggae billboard chart where we sell or download 50 downloads and go into the reggae billboard chart or the reggae iTunes. That is the billboard chart where major artists grace. 
that are with Justin Bieber, Bieber them and Miley Cyrus them and, and them people them. going to the billboard chart. Furthermore, that was the era where you had to sell music and get your songs played on real radio station real pop stations not the era when you can buy streams not the era where majority of your streams coming from bots down a Kagistan and India so to make you look like you're streaming 300 million streams me not buy streams I could have been buying streams to look like me a stream a hundred million streams per week. When I look on the top cities or on the top countries where I stream from are India and Kagistan and Malawi and some places where reggae not even play. So we know that. So get it straight, nightly fix. Mr. Vegas entered the billboard charts when we had to sell CDs, 7-inch, and get play from pop stations. That is a feat when 95% of dancehall artists not achieve. That top billboard 100 day. Get it in our head. When you come in a dancehall space, when you go to university, go get degree, I go, when the mother said, I go to a good school. I want to come into journalism. Ent when you come into entertainment journalism, you cannot operate a platform. You want to oblivious to these things. So when Don said Spice, I tell you, say, if you look up how many songs I have in the billboard, the amount of time when you talk about Vegas, when you should have that information upon your fingertip. It means, and it is obvious, so you have me as one of the scrub them. It means, say, you know, overlook my contribution to music, you know, overlook or belittle my input into dance and music. Because I'm sure, say, if she did talk about any other artist within the top ten, only that have the information on the fingertip. Because when you go to school, obviously go to school for what you come and do now. Unless you never go to school for this or what do, and you just do it as a side hustle. Because you know, real degree what you get, you can't get no job. Unless that's go on. But if you actually matriculated in this field, you supposed to at least know the top 20 dancehall artists and reggae artists chart history. So if you skip over Vegas because me is a person where talk enough, chat enough, give problem, whatever you call it, terms it, trouble people, whatever you claim, you can't skip over the music part of it. So obviously, you in a field where you are qualified. So one another day they are giggle, 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 and I laugh. One look like clowns. Because this is information we're not privy to. So one should have done, if one know one go talk about Vegas, and for the amount of time one talk about Vegas, one should have didn't know this. So Vegas are one of the artists where, as a solo act, not with a feature, Enter the billboard of all billboard chart. Billboards chart. Uno should have known that. That are our feet where, where just uno just laugh about. You see? And that are with real dance hall, hardcore, no twanging, no nothing, nothing, no get no feature from no pop artists that are me alone. You see? And me, Pitbull, get cooler from. And cooler 
entered the billboard chart, went into the billboard chart all the way up to 25. So I still I get the money from that too. Because when Pitbull, who became a mega star, stole Pull Up, he became the Pitbull one on one now. And that was him springboard. On a need for go do some research on the history of dancehall before I talk about my name, before I speak on artist. You see? Uno not qualified in other field of bridging. Uno would have known that Pitbull Cool came from Pull Up. And that's the only reason why Pull Up only went into in at 98. And Pitbull took the momentum and went to 25. Uno would have did no say Mr. Vegas was the one who took the cool dance rhythm to radio. When you hear Nina Sky them, when you hear Elephant Man remix Juke Girl, and Mr. Vegas took scatter rhythm to radio in the United States. And Pitbull stole my song. So me never get in at the top 20 of the Billboard chart. An achievement where 95% of dancehall artists now have. Educate on yourself before you talk on my name. Keep it at the part where you say whatever you perceived about me like talking, talking, me like ray, ray, ray. You know, keep it there so. When you know go to the music part, you know go get in a trouble. Because you know mess with the youth, them legacy. This is a reggae billboard. So I could set that straight. So you can understand. Yeah? Sorry for the camera I move like something something, but we have to teach them and we not this a means of this a medium we are use, we don't really have the, the thing them for clip them in and out. So learn. Sit down and learn little bit. Come to the school. Come to class because when you go to university and in a music I say when you come in a music for being whatever when you come in a music to be, but you're not uneducated. You're not ready for the failure. Sit down and learn. Sit down a little bit. Mr. Vegas, yeah, this hour, billboard, you see that? When Don said spice, force ripe spice, dramatic spice, come into music, yeah, the music conversation, we just laugh because we know she's she not, she not too bright. This is billboard. What is this? The Latin billboard. Latin rhythm airplay. Educate to yourself. Wanna see ya so? Suelta. Wanna see ya so? Number 10. Wanna see ya so? Mr. Vegas. Wanna see them name that we Mr. Vegas sit among? Have some manners. Understand on yourself. You see? Understand on yourself. Come again. Come again. Can we go learn today? Wanna see Mr. Vegas? Have manners. Heads eye. One song in the billboard? No, no, no. Listen to me, you have the Billboard R&B chart. This is the chart where TJ and Brian Messiah get into. This is the other Billboard chart. This is the R&B chart. Billboard R&B chart. The US Billboard R&B chart. Number 69. You see? So ironic, heads eye at 69. You see this? UK. This is the national chart in England. Number 16. Another achievement where 90% of dancehall artists no achieve. This is the national chart in England. You see that? Have manners. Look again. This is a head's eye in a 1998. 99, 98. Look ya. See? Come back in at the chart again. 71, national chart. Then can't get enough of it. Come here. This is pull up. Look good. This are the national chart in America. And this is the R&B billboard chart. So there we go already. We already gone what? One, 
two billboard chart. So one and us say zero point zero one song in songs in the billboard chart. No, 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 no. Come correct it, night to fix. Unless you don't want to stand as idiots. We're ignorant to the history of dance hall. Uno can keep it there. But us no say we are go there to point out the facts. Cause we not dead and gone yet. We wanna can, we wanna can manipulate the real record. You see? Uno no get for sitting and giggle giggle over my legacy. This is another song. This is num, this is what? Number 68 and number 98 in the real US. This mean the top 98 song in America. This included Tennessee. This included San Francisco. This included Chicago. The whole of America. Come again. Hot work. Because obviously, on just coming at music in the internet era. So come again. Make a walk slow. R&B US chart. This are the chart again where TJ just went into and Byron Messiah, the Billboard R&B and Hip Hop chart. Number 58. Put some respect for my name. Because me will take it legal. So I want to make sure so I want to correct this nightly fix. Me no busy with Don's fool fool spice. Because she has to do what she's doing to get to no attention. You see? But you no have a responsibility because you no claim say you no a journalist. That's where the issue is. This is not like some little fool fool artists that come out or some little fool fool people when no when no present themselves as journalists. So me hope say, just like I see when me I say other things, I no see this and correct it. So this is at work. Hot girl today, Mr. Vega, Sean Paul, number 66. Another Billboard song. Not the Billboard 100, the Billboard Hip Hop and R&B. Come again, broke it down. 103 in the R&B, never jumping at the top 100. But of course it entered the chart. Okay? Okay? Uno have some manners. Have some manners. Beyonce, Mr. Vegas. 6th of December 2020, 2014. Standing on the sun. Official hip hop and R&B singles chart. Number 23. Have manners. No, because you don't see me out here, I'm speak on social issues. You don't think so. You don't can mess with my legacy. You don't go do no research on Mr. Vegas. Go do no research. Why don't you think so? I'm still touring and I don't can cancel me. No matter how I try in the base market. One of the things that he, he's still out there doing shows all over the world. Because when me had the opportunity to put in real music, when me had the opportunity to put in real hits, I did the work. Through all the hurricanes and obstacles I'm facing at dance hall, me not get no easy road in a dance hall. I'm a carve out. A legacy of my own. Where very few dance hall artists can beat them chess and say they achieved what Mr. Vegas achieved. Nominated for the Soul Train Award. Won the Mobo Award, Music of Black Origin. When you had to do real numbers to win the Mobo. Not now when a popularity contest. When you have to do real numbers to win the mobile. Have manners. Number 
No one not talk about when I not present my data for my music. No one will not do when I not manipulate the data on my music. You don't know what to say, I'll know me not talk about the reggae billboard. You don't realize that. You don't realize me not talk about the reggae billboard where you don't talk about. Because, listen, 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 listen. You don't have manners, you know. Una gab manaz. Una gab manaz. Una gab manaz. Okay. All right. Boom 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 bam bam bam. Popular with the military shit. Others created Nike became music. Next thing a head's eye. Um, this is anti-war sex song. Peak at number sixty-eight on the.